Okay, good evening now. I am not hearing anything. I don't think that will get me up. I feel good. I feel good. <laughs> Okay, I'm basically trying to set my alarms. Tomorrow, I have to walk a bit of a ways to get... Well, actually, not walk, but I have to... There's a hill, and it's exhausting to walk up. That's not an exaggeration by any means. It's just exhausting. So, I take a bus that I normally take to just get up the hill, and then after that, I walk the rest of the way to the bus. It's really not that far, but the hill always kills me. I feel like if I had enough time in the morning to walk up the hill, I could do it at my own pace and it not be an issue, but it's exhausting as it is and I don't want to do that. So... Anyways. Ah. I guess it just kind of picks whatever. I mean, that'll be fine, right? I want it at max speed, too. We're gonna go with that. And then... No. Okay. Um, I'm setting it for 6.30. I don't know if you can see that. Now you can. Just to kind of start getting up. That's just for tomorrow. And then I'm going to do another 6 alarm. If I don't get up, I'll do 6.45 tomorrow. And these, alar these alarms will vary, of course, but this is just to get me up for tomorrow. Technically speaking, I could already... I am halfway ready. Everything that I would do in the morning consists of me getting out of bed, which is hard to do. It's, um... Making sure I have everything in my work bag, which is already laid out over here, as you see. That's my hat. And everything else is underneath it. My work bag is in the dryer, so I can easily throw all of that shit in my work bag and be ready. The last thing I would probably have to do is my own personal hygiene. Brushing my teeth, brushing my hair, um, grabbing my snacks from the fridge, because a lot of it needs to be microwaved. Microwaved? Refrigerated refrigerated so I need to grab my snacks feed the cats and get dressed if I haven't said that already I hadn't so got dressed get dressed you know that kind of thing and then by then maybe I have a few extra minutes to lay down or do whatever it is I need to do put my shoes on of course grab a jacket which I need to grab that jacket and then head out the door be ready 10 minute walk down the hill, wait for the bus, about an hour, about 15, 20 minutes, 30 at the very least, hop on the bus, hop up, uh, drive, maybe two stops, and then I get off, actually, maybe if that, maybe one stop, yeah, one stop, it's really one stop, and then I get off at the next stop, so there's that. It's literally just the hill that I have an issue with. The rest of the way I can walk and it's perfectly fine. And the bus circulates every like 10 to 15 minutes. So they're, they're coming in a circle and they're coming in pairs. So I see one on the other side come, the next one's coming this way, the way that I need it to come. So it, it helps. And I have to go downtown tomorrow for my shift. So I know it'll be a good day. Especially because I feel very prepared and not overwhelmed about getting ready for work. Which I want to see if maybe that's why I've been really dreading work is the whole, maybe I'm just dreading it because, you know, I, I don't want to go. Or maybe I'm dreading it because I have to put in the work to actually get ready in the morning rather than just hopping out of work, hopping out of bed. I'm going to do 7.15 just in case I'm not up. 7.10, 7.15. I like to set my alarms 10 minutes apart. Because if they're not 10 minutes apart, I'm not getting up. 
it has to constantly keep going off and I feel bad because every morning I wake Lovey up with my alarms he goes back to sleep he rolls over and then falls back to sleep which is fine but I do tend to wake him up especially because I am not the quietest in the morning I will slam those drawers because they don't want to close I will make a lot of noise if I step on Annie or if I trip on something or if I hit the wall in the morning because I always turn the light on now because I cannot work in the dark I cannot function in the dark <laughs> so lights are crucial here so again rolls over he's asleep again no problem He's a pretty sound sleeper, so I really don't have an issue with that. But he does want me to get him up tomorrow morning, so um, I think he's going to switch um, good, uh, uh, um, 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 stores again. I think he's going to switch stores again, so uh, he wants to check it out and get up early and go see what they have to offer. So, got to get him up. So he'll probably get up with me, but I probably won't wake him up until 7 something. Because I'm definitely trying to get up at 6. That way I can finish getting what I need done, get dressed, pack anything else I need to throw in my bag. Again, hygiene, shit, brush my hair, brush, maybe moisturize in the morning like I've been doing. Um, brush my teeth, brush my hair, that kind of thing. Put my shoes on, and then get everything else ready other than that again pretty much ready for work tomorrow so I'm not worried but I'm gonna continue to set these alarms about 10 to 30 minutes apart or yeah 10 to 30 minutes apart I'll do 735 7 these times are non-specific they're just what I feel I want to do. I'm gonna do a 7:40, and then do a 7:55. I want to be out the door around seven something. That way, I can wait. I have time to wait on this bus to come because they don't always come when they're supposed to. Or apparently, you miss them, but they don't even come by you. I can't tell y'all how many times I have had that happen. Again, I want to be out the door before 8 o'clock. So I'm going to set that time as a marker. So I know I need to be out the door before 8 o'clock. Speaking of which, now it is 8 o'clock. Lovey will be out of work in 30 minutes. I couldn't think. Lovey will be out of work in about 30 minutes. It'll take them another 30 minutes to even get home. So I've got a little lax, laxing time in time <laughs> oh my god ah I didn't get the wires done again I'm so mad I'm watching YouTube which I've been doing all day and loving it I'm also trying to work on my notion I've got all my backgrounds done for things I want to do laundry is drying I got another load drying I got a load out that I really need to get care of before Lovey gets home just because I know he's gonna start with the whole you need to do the laundry and put it up right away which he's right He's right. I'm just stubborn and I don't want to. Next load is done. Perfect! I can get two loads done in one sitting. Good! And then I also threw in our throw blanket because it's, it needs some help. I also threw in a sheet. So that's why I've got a different blanket on me right now. Um, what else? I fixed Annie's water bowl. I have yet to do her litter box. It's under the bed, so I need help getting it out from under there. Not that I can't do it. It's just it's under the bed, and it's it's hard to get to. So that, you know, breaking that new poop scooper, right? Y'all know what I'm talking about. Anyways, um, I moved the pumpkin. I got the chair clean for Annie. Did not do my desk yet. As you can tell, it's a mess. Oh, the last few things I want to get done for sure before I go to bed are my desk and the clothes. Definitely. And then Lovey and I can work on the wires another day. But it really is pissing me off. So I may ask him if we could work on it tonight. Just because I want to be able to walk in front of my mirror. The wires are blocking it. And I don't want to step on anything important. 
And honestly, I'm worried about Annie chewing shit up. Not that she has, but she's been she's been known to tear up a, t- a cord or two. But my desk, y'all, my desk. And I know he's going to say something about having food in the room. He, we're not bad about it, per se. We've been doing really good with taking the food out and everything. But that's from last night. He brought Kane's home uh, leftovers that they had for lunch. So uh, I had Kane's for dinner. Chicken and fries. So I want to take care of that before he gets home. Laundry. This headband is falling farther and farther back on my head. But I love it. It's so freaking cute. Um, but yeah, I'm watching YouTube. All is good. This is kind of how I'm going to end the night. And I'll see y'all tomorrow morning for a brand new video. It'll be so glamorous. I've also got my links that I've been using or using or searching on my Google. Not that it's not there just because it's Google. So it'll pop up anywhere. Of course it's Google. I've got my links open. (laughs) Probably not good to have this many open though. It's fine. It's fine. Um, I've got my alarm set. I should probably update my calendar because, yeah, nothing. Oh, I wanted to check my bank real quick. Hold on. Okay, um, so I'm going to have to call my bank tomorrow because a few things aren't adding up. So let me put that on my list. Call me bank. Oh, shit, i got to find that number. Um, call us for go, Deary, Grandma, call UFCU. Okay, I gotta call the bank tomorrow, figure that out, because that's not adding up. I should also call my company as well. Talk to Eric. Money. Alright, um, yeah, that, that doesn't make any sense. At all. Okay, um, hmm. Room looks good, clean, tidy. Andy's still out there. I've already fed the cats. I've already fed the cats. This is just, yeah. Hold on. Where's my bow? (laughs) Okay, there we go. Okay, hair's kind of everywhere. Alright. There we go. We're back in business. Sort of. <laughs> um, I have other videos wanting to go up, needing to go up. Boyfriend video is one. I want to do several videos of boyfriend. I have them all on my phone, of course. But yeah, it's still weather tomorrow. I'm kind of curious. Should I check? It's 82 right now. <gasps> you don't say. Well, that went away fast. Uh, well, okay. Okay, I like that. Perfect. That'll work perfectly. 68 degrees around 6 in the morning. Stays that way. Stays within the 60s till about 9. And then we hit the 70s. For 70s. Ending the day on the 80s. Not bad. But we're supposed to get rain tonight. Like thunderstorm rain. Oh, that'll be nice. Maybe I can talk Levy into opening the windows tonight. We both really like the rain. Whenever it rains, we go play in it. It's fun. Um, But yeah, it's showing rain tonight. 75% chance. Woo! That's fun. I'm happy. Um, so, okay. Maybe I'll go play in the rain tonight. 
Um, but yeah, I need to get to work before it gets a little too late. And yeah, I'm gonna do what I can about my desk. Do what I can. <laughs> and check on the, go get the dryer. Go get the dryer. I'm gonna bring the dryer in here and then that's how I'm gonna get my clothes. No, we have a hamper, don't worry. Oh, I gotta put my jacket with my bag stuff because that's important. That we need to get pumpkin carving shit so that me and Lovey can do the pumpkin carving! Where's my list? Where's my, where's the list? Thank you, Pum. We didn't want to cooperate. This list is getting longer and longer. Will I ever complete the tasks? I swear, I need just a fold. I need a folder alone for just looking shit up. Because 90% of what's on this list here, you can't even see it here, but. There. No, no, no. 90% of what's on this list here is just looking up shit. Now, what was I going to do? Oh. Get pump. Pumpkin. That's not how you spell that. Carving. Still can't spell. Tools. There we go. Woo! So excited. Okay. It's falling off my head again. Anyways, gotta go. Good night!